All right, lads and women lads, it's my last chance. It's the 13th week in iRacing Series 3, and so I have to get enough points to be promoted to C-Class in sports cars. That's why today I'm at Alton Park in the rookie class in the Global Mazda MX-5 Cup. A great track and a race that I should have a good chance of picking up good points and good safety rating in. So join me and let's get into qualifying. And here we are, coming across the line to start my first timed lap at Alton Park. So it's a nice fast corner to start off. And I've done that pretty well, taking a nice bit of speed through. Now we're down a hill over the crest here. And then in a little divot in the road. Rotating the car and then using the, uh, the inside curb on the exit now up to the uh, long straight little lift off here and then we've got the hairpin now braking hard so i did okay in practice i was in the 155s it put me p6 but obviously that might be much better in this split that i end up in I've raced at Alton Park many a time, uh, including on this channel before, so I am familiar with at least the track layout, if nothing else. And slow through here, so my idea is then to use that to get a better exit into this corner because we're coming up to a long straight, so I should be able to maximize my straight line speed now. And then a fast right-hander coming up around here. Oh, a little bit of a slide on. That will scrub some speed off, unfortunately. But still, overall, it's been an okay lap so far. We just have one corner to go. And it's a bit of a tricky one, that, because it's over a crest sort of mid-corner. Can be tough. Coming up now to complete our first lap and now to go for a second. Where's that time? Ooh, first corner. So I've done a 154.9. I'm in P6 at the moment. Final corner now. Oh, and we've definitely ruined it now. That was poor. So across the line, currently in P11. We have a lot of work to do if we want to get a good place, but we were very clean in, in qualifying, and let's hope we can do that in the race as well to get that safety rating for C-Class. So join me, and let's head to the grid. We're expecting you to finish in at least... P and the 17. lights are on. P15. Get ready. Okay, standing start. Floor it. Green, green, and green. we're away. It's not a particularly brilliant start, but... We are still in striking distance of everyone, and I say striking not actually with the intent to strike anyone. Uh, okay, good. We've kept our position there. This corner right down here, I fear, is going to be a bit of a hazard. It, it isn't. The guy in front is nice. Wow, okay. Usually that's a complete mess, but I guess not. Oh God! Oh my! Oh my God! Holy penis! There was cars flying everywhere. There was literally a guy that did like eight barrel rolls. Right, we've made up a couple of places though because of that accident, and I also overtook someone else. There's a guy that spun off. He went through those tires. Is what it looked like. I haven't managed those braking zones very nicely, but uh, was just trying to avoid contact with anyone in front, braking early uh, to avoid that. So, looks like there's going to be a move in front. Uh, right, now we're on the back straight. We're up in... Uh, oof. It's hard to tell what position we're in, but we are getting a nice toe. Everyone is sort of still in a line here. <coughs> still fighting going on for position in front of me. It's bringing me closer to both of them. 
And coming up to the final corner. I'm making a move down the inside. Little bit of contact. Barely anything. It didn't even register. Not even a zero incident points. I don't want to get squeezed over too far out. Oh, he's just managed to get in front of me. P13. Uh, there wasn't room to send it down the inside. And now I've got a little... No, not wide. I'm in P13. Good defending from the pink car in front of me. And we've got a good exit. It's better than either of these guys. Uh, we're going to send it through the middle. Incredible. Oh, bit of contact. Oh, my God. There's incidents everywhere. I've missed a shift, but I've overtaken a few people. One or two on merit and two just from complete mess and accidents. Right. It looks like we might be up in P8 at the moment, thanks to all that chaos. Which is good, very good position for us to be in. So who's in front of us? It's Cesaroni. Or Cesaroni. I don't know. I don't speak Italian. I did have lasagna for dinner, but that's a different story. Five minutes to go in this ten minute race. It's a short one here. Settling into the race a bit here. Nothing has really happened in front of me or uh, with me myself. There's been a change for the lead. I'm constantly lapping now about the uh, 155s. That's where I've pretty much been consistently for the whole, you know, session. That's including qualifying and practice. So very, very consistent. Coming up to the hairpin again. Oh, that is smooth. That is smooth. Just one steering input. That's all you need. I'm still within sight of the guys in front, but the gap is widening. It's 3.3 seconds. I just can't make any meaningful dent in that, really. Oh, oh, this guy's had an incident. Oh, but he's a back marker. Oh, dear. It is the white flag lap now. Okay, we don't need to race this guy. He's not hampering us and he's not uh, not our race either so let's just keep controlled here there's no one you know within touching distance of me behind next car next rival is a 20 second gap so coming down here to the last corner taking it nice and slow and Good job for that because we nearly went off anyway. But coming up across the line to finish in a strong, solid P8. It's me. P8. And that okay, is zero up. incident points. That is going to have a huge impact on our safety rating. Before I check the results, don't go anywhere because we have a second race coming. And if you want to talk everything sim racing and racing IRL, join my Discord. Link is in the description. Also, if you're looking to buy any products from Amazon, Track Racer, or Moza, brands that I use all the time, I have affiliate links in the description. It costs nothing extra to you, but it does help support the channel. Thank you very much. And the results are in. Oof! So close. We just need 0.02 more to get that C-Class promotion this season. A buzzer beater we need. Now to switch it up a bit, I do need a clean race, but I want to have some fun as well. So I'm in the Ferrari 296 GT3 again at Spa. It's going to be hard to get a result, but all we need is clean. So join me and let's get into qualifying. All right, now we are rounding the final corner and coming up to cross the line to start my first qualifying lap at Spa, the remodeled Spa. So slightly different, a lot more gravel traps now. But I really like it. It feels great. I've been doing some very consistent laps in practice. So I'm looking to set something nice here in qualifying. Oh, bollocks. Not the ideal start. But here we are coming up again to the white flag for our only lap now at Spa. We need to make sure we get it right through Eau Rouge now and Radion. Keep two wheels on. Yes, we have done. Okay, no problem. 
So now we just got to finish the rest of the lap smoothly. Not the greatest couple of corners, but we've kept it on. It should be okay. Bit of understeer. Now, any tyres dipping in the gravel isn't off track, so we have to be really careful coming up to Puon. Strict limits here too. And we are working hard now. Decreasing. It's now 31 Celsius. Uh-oh. Shit! Bollocks and balls and absolute cock. Couldn't pull it out when I needed it, so we're going to be starting near the back, but maybe that will help us in terms of incident into the first lap. Remember, all we need is safety rating. Join me and let's head to the grid. Oh, this is interesting. A standing start. Okay, Nick, be ready. This will be a standing start. Green, green, green. And we're away. Oh, what a start. What a start this is. Coming up to the first corner. I've made up quite a few places here. It's a bit tricky around here. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, a little mistake. And I've been punted into the wall. That is not good. Not the start to this race that we needed. Whoa, holy freaking hell, mate. Oh, God. Oh, this is terrible. This is terrible news. It's all gone wrong. It's all gone wrong in our bid for promotion to C-Class. We have eight incident points already. All we need is a plus 0.02. All right, we've been released. We're coming out behind some other cars. We're not last. But we are a couple of laps down on the, uh, on the main pack. There's no one coming around the corner now. Right, next car is in front of me, so I am still racing here, but remember we have safety rating to salvage from this. 10 minutes to go out of 15 minute race. There's been an incident here, and yes, the car in front of me has gone off. So, we are going to come up behind him very shortly. We need to minimize our I rating downfall if we can, because this is a big one right now. Unsafe pit exit. How, how, how did I get an unsafe pit exit? And how are they only giving that to me now? What the f... All right, so my, my race is not on here anyway. So there's going to be no point trying to pass him. Danger for no reason. I've got to drive through anyway. To be fair, I've got three laps to serve the penalty, so I don't have to come in right now. So let's not. Let's see if I can pass him and then... If I can pass him and make a little bit of a gap, it'll soften the blow. I would love to get P23. I don't want to lose high rating to go under 300, uh, 1300. That's a new fastest lap for... Oh, f Right, my plan of uh, overtaking and building a gap didn't work, so I'm going to pit on this lap to serve my penalty. And hopefully that means all the leaders will go past in that time as well. Give me some clean air to race in. Uh, I don't know where I'll pop into. Can't see that far down the standings, but hopefully a nice little pocket by myself. I promise you, when I was practicing for this race, it was so smooth. I was setting good lap times, lap after lap. Not a mate, not pole lap times, but good ones. And then let's make sure to exit the pit safely this time. Traffic on the exit, keep it tight. I think I must Cold have overstepped the white line last time, but I don't remember doing so. Five minutes to go in this 15 minute race, just a third left for that all important promotion. Adjusting my brake bias a bit to 
you know, I'm not looking for super fast lap times anymore. I just need to stay on track. So a bit higher brake bias um, and see if we can get a bit more stable in braking. Started to get a bit of sliding through some of those corners. So I think we should still be okay with this rating. Surely nine out of 17. It's not great, but surely that's still worth more than a plus 0.02. Come on. I've had better with worse, let's put it that way. Right, it is the white flag lap as well. So just this one lap to go. And here we are at the bus stop chicane, rounding it for the final time this race. I hope that has been enough. I really hope this has been enough. Come on, and across the line, we are coming now in P23. It's not a great race, but is it enough? Come on, baby, show me the money. Ow, oh, tits. We didn't make it now, but this isn't over. Next video is gonna be the very last races of series three. So stay tuned, subscribe for more to see that. Only weakness I have is for the brunettes You already know I'll kill any shit I do next No kids so I'm raising the roof Next year they'll admit they just stands like an Uzbek